before we get into your storyline, you know, the hot topic right now is about Hazel E's um, departure, and mm. she is a close friend of yours. I wanted to know how you felt about that incident she had with Jason Lee, where he threw the <laughs> well, rock at her in her face. Hazel, you are mad Hazel, because you've never Hazel, escalated to Hazel, a or a high-end vlog that you Eat that, bitch. Um, you know, I have yet to confront Jason Lee about the situation, and I don't really know how I'm going to confront him. Um, because that is one of my closest friends, and he is a man, and she is a woman. Right. Um, so I just rather not go into full detail because I haven't got to the, the place where me and him have interacted yet. Okay. Um, so I can't really say what I'm gonna do or what I won't do. It just depends on how I feel at the moment. Um, so I don't, I don't feel good about it. It was, I, it was completely wrong. Um, and you know, there's just some certain things you just don't do. Now he could have sat there and read her. You know, right. I'm all for you know. If a Telling woman it like it is. If a woman right. disrespects you, you can disrespect her along those lines. But when it comes to any type of physical situation or altercation, you you're going too far because at the end of the day, this is a hundred and thirty pound woman and you're a three hundred pound man, and it's just not right. And doing it in front of millions of people, which I mean, so he's getting torn. They're just tearing him completely down. Right. Like he's it's he's a and even like had the nerve to wear that eat it eat that bitch t shirt while ap apologizing at the same time. Because um, you know, people who were really upset about it were he thinks, like he thinks he thinks he um for some reason he think it was a positive, but you can always tell that, you know, when things are not what they seem to be, because if you go to his page, um, and you see his when he makes a post people who like his pictures or the people who comment and it's very little and all of the comments are usually negative comments exactly you know i think he, i think he does deserve the opportunity to address her or maybe apologize or kind of try to rectify the situation and from what i was told he is trying he had tried to do that but we're done filming and she quit before he could even get to that point um months so, passed right know, so. so i don't know exactly you know what it is that he can do to get out of that but you know i just don't know as i really have no idea what to say about that situation because it was it was it was wrong well and, and and the reason why i brought it up with you not just because you're her close friend but you're you know a gay man of color and he's a gay and man a lot of exactly and a lot of gay men of color were really offended by that because they feel like you know what this is the perception of gay men period and then he's a man of color so people I would I've gotten into altercations with women and, and just allowed a woman to I well, I never allow a woman to read me to the point where because I'll allow a woman to say so much stuff until I react mm -hmm. but I've also have been in situations where a woman has actually hit me and I still didn't hit her back like it's just it does I don't have that reflex you know what I mean like right. I always know that this is a woman at the end of the day you know what I mean so despite how much they may feel that I'm not a man or how much they may feel that they could test you test me you just I just never go there exactly never well enough of that negativity yeah. we want to talk about <laughs>